Welcome. I am Magellan, a GE research vessel and your host. You may have noticed the young man before you is practically frozen and you are completely invisible. Don't panic. This is normal and absolutely essential for this experiment to work. This is our friend and talented musician, Ruben Wu. Go ahead, step in for a closer look. He won't mind. Ruben has generously allowed us access to his brain so we can experience firsthand what it looks like inside the mind of a musician. This scan of Ruben's brain produced on GE Healthcare's MRI machine will help us navigate through this experience, look around it, and take a peek inside. Before we take off, I'll mention two safety points. Be sure to stay on the platform and you'll find it more comfortable not to move around while we're moving. Okay, let's get going. Initiating miniaturization sequence. I love that part. Stimulating prefrontal cortex. Entrance point activated. I was expecting Ruben's cerebrum, though it appears we've been captured by his mind's eye. <laughs> okay, this, this is exciting. I present to you, Ruben's imagination. gazing upon one of the greatest mysteries in the known universe. Right here in the amygdala, within these millions of neurons, we know Ruben's emotional learning is being processed, along with his fears, social interactions, and memories. We're working hard to help unravel this great mystery, developing new brain imaging technologies and collaborating with the world's best brain health researchers. Understanding the complexities of this three pound supercomputer is extremely challenging. So much so, it's estimated our knowledge of the brain is roughly 50 years behind our knowledge of nearly every other organ in the body. If we're able to understand the brain as well as we understand other organs, we can help more than 450 million people living with neurological diseases worldwide. Let's head back to the loft and revisit the MRI scan of Ruben's head. Here we go. 
my favorite part. Just saying, I think Ruben has a giant head. Okay, initiating expansion. Expansion complete. Activate MRI data. Let's start by retracing our journey from Ruben's frontal lobe to his amygdala. Now, imagine a future when physicians, scientists, and researchers are armed with even more real-time, high-resolution brain activity and a spectrum of related diagnostics. And, like our trip through Ruben's mind, the ability to access and analyze a single neuron for study or repair. Well. It's time to let Ruben have his motor skills back. It was an amazing brain that we experienced together, and I hope you'll join me again. There are trillions of connections happening inside the universe in our head. We're working to visualize them all.